by using prime factorization. Die eerste ding wat ons gedoen het, is ons het gekyk na hierdie breek aan die begin, en ons het gesê, daar is nergens een plus of een minus teken wat terme kan sky in die teller of in die noemer nie. That's the first thing you have to be on the lookout for. You can't have a plus or a minus sign, either at the top or at the bottom of the fraction. Okay, then we said, we break them up into their prime factors. So 4, if we prime factorize that, is 2 squared. And 12, if we use the prime factors, is 2 squared times 3. Volgende ding wat ons gedoen het, is ons het net ons gewone exponent dit toegepast. So remember, if it's a bracket with the exponent on the outside, you multiply the exponents with one another. And dit is dan hoe ons tot by hierdie stapie hier gekop het. Everyone okay up to there? I'm not by here, Proto Don. Okay. To do us say you own it. Now we're going to look at the different sorts of grounds. So we looked at the base of two first, and we said we have one at the top and one at the bottom. Now you know your exponent law say if you have the same base and they're being divided, then you subtract the exponents from one another. So that's what we did there. Use your brackets. Maak seker jy gebruik jou haakies. Ok, quickly attempt to do the 3 as well. So the base 3. Okay, so we have two occurrences of the base 3. One at the top, one at the bottom. So, weer eens deel ek. Nou, onthou, wat sê my exponent vete vir my wanneer ek deel? Dan trek ek die exponente van mekaar af. So, ek gaan hy x minus 1 minus x minus 2. Once again, make sure you use your brackets. And your last step will be to simplify that. Okay, so the 2x and the 2x cancel out one another, and then I'm left with 2 plus 4, which is 6. And by here, I have the x and the minus x cancel out one another, so then I have 3 to the minus 1. Due to the power of 6 is 64, maar jy hoef het die uit jou kop uit te ken, jy kan het soms net in jou snakker kanoor intik, en dan maal jy om net met 3, and then I have 1, 9, 2. And that's the beauty of this one, you can go from something that looks like this, to something as simple as 100 and 192.
Okay. Ek nou beveel ek gewaas hoe maak ek die prime factor op julle saafrika naar te kry nie het ek. A shortcut to get it. Good, okay. So you just, if you have it on your calculator, you just say 20 is equal to. And then you just say shift fact. You'll see the fact button is the one that has like a koliki and then a comma, comma, comma. Okay, so ons het eerst gekyk en gesien, hier is nergens een plus of een minus wat my termen sky en die teller of in die noemer. So then I go ahead and I break the 20, the 25, the 50 and the 10 up into their prime factors. So ek gaan nou gaan en sê, doeine kan ek skryf as 2 kwadraat maal met 5 en dis wat jylle haak hier tot die maag x plus 1. 25 as a product of its prime factors is 5 squared to the power of x minus 2. Okay, everyone happy up to that step? We good to go? And now pass my exponent beta 2. So this is 2 to the power of 2x plus 2. Like that. Okay, now we identify like bases. So there we have a 2 and a 2 and another 2. So do you guys agree it'll be the top exponent, die 2x plus 2, die ene. En dan gaan ek die ene en die ene aftrek. Nee, want ek deel moes dier die onderste gedeelte. I'm dividing by those bottom two. So I'm going to say minus x plus 3 minus x plus 1. Jy kon nou eerst gegaan het en in die teller vereenvoudig het en in die noemer vereenvoudig het. You can go that route as well if that's easier for you. Okay, so that's 2 sorted. Now I'm looking at 5. guys agree there's the two at the top I'm going to add together because they're being multiplied with one another and then I'm going to subtract the two at the bottom again Yeah. 
Oké, okay, en van hier af gaan ons net vereenvoudig. So ons gaan sê, die 2x en die minus x en die minus x kanseleer mekaar uit. So I'm left with 2 to the power of negative 2. Okay, do you guys agree all of this should be at the bottom now? If you type that into your calculator, it's quite a big one. It's that 5 to the power of 10 that makes it so big. Like that. Okay, grade 11s, I'm giving you time to start with those in class now.